Okay, so I am about to go into Macy's right now with a friend of mine who is looking to buy brand new furniture for her apartment. And I'm so excited. I will show you around some of the furniture things that we're gonna see and hopefully we'll get to pick out some fun stuff. I discovered Macy's two years ago because of a friend of mine who was helping me decorate my house and I totally forgot about this place. I absolutely love Macy's. They Their service is impeccable. The furniture quality is great and they help you to customize your furniture with different fabrics and whatnot. It's wonderful. You should totally try it. Also, you can't take me anywhere. <laughs> Macy's was having a sale today and y'all this rug was so soft. I think my friend's gonna go ahead and buy it. It's amazing and I love this bedroom set. Okay, so now we are in a thrift store. This is a hospice thrift store. It's very organized. There's lots to choose from. Prices were a little bit high, but that's okay. There was a lot of collectibles there and dishware. I always like looking at kitchen stuff whenever I come into a thrift store. It was awesome. We are in a thrift store right now, and there are all sorts of new little finds here that I think are so cool. Prices are a little bit higher, but it's the hospice um, thrift store and finding really, really cute things. So I'm gonna show you guys around. You fill my soul with light the day we met. I don't wanna leave your side, no. Have me by your side when sunsets I hope you'll still want me I hope you'll still need me a million years from now the seasons are changed. hey there okay so I am at home goods right now I just pulled up in the parking lot and I have $25 that my friend gave me, Let's see, make sure you guys can hear me, um, $25 that my friends gave me for my birthday. Let's go into Home Goods and see how much can we buy with just $25. It's gonna be an interesting challenge. I love going into Home Goods. It's kind of my kryptonite because I'll go in there and I will spend like way more than $25. <laughs> and every time my husband sees a Home Goods bag, he just goes, Oh God, how much did you spend? <laughs> I'm like, we're fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's all good. Um, so $25 is all I have. This is my budget and let's go see what we can get into. I'm excited. all sorts of wooden bowls and things but I think I found like some other white all white bowls that would go kind of with my china set that seemed to be $3.99 a bowl so I might get a few of those um oh I kind of like this <laughs> me I'll buy random things I mean who doesn't need a flying pig how much is he oh he's out of my budget he's $17 um do you own one of these things to make guacamole in or to grind spices or whatever, he's $10. That is a mortar and pestle, I think is what it's called. Um, I also love little bowls like this to be able to put stuff in like nuts or chips or, well, you wouldn't put chips in, you'd probably put nuts, but it's like $7.99 for this little bowl. It's just a, I mean, if we're gonna try to really make $25 stretch, we gotta like think more bank, more bank for a buck, right? Now this is great. These are a nice size bowl for mixing. It's um, a two and a half quart and it's $4.99. So I really kind of like this. I might put it in the buggy and just see if it's something that I wanna keep. Um, 
They have a really good selection of casserole dishes here too, glass ones. And like here is a stainless steel scooper that looks like it is, let's see here, it's $8. But sometimes you need a good scooper to scoop. I absolutely love looking at casserole dishes and this one with the lid is a major score. Um, I do try to buy a lot of my casserole dishes at thrift stores for a lot less, but lately they've been looking pretty expensive. So here are, it's $6.99 for a brand new one. They had uh, for $16.99 a set with lids below um, where it's like two of them together, I think, or maybe it was a four piece set, I think. So I don't know, I like both. Okay, so everybody needs like a mid-size cookie sheet. This one is $5.99. And my cookie sheets are like really getting corroded and nasty. <laughs> so I might, I'm gonna put this in the buggy too. This is like, I'm gonna think about you. I'm gonna totally think about it. I also really love this wooden spoon. This is a really great wooden spoon and it's $4. And it's got kind of a long handle on it. I think this would be really good for cooking. I, I think I might need to have this. I might, yeah, I think, I think I do. I think I really need to have this. I mean, should I get this? It's an A. Not for $8. <laughs> I mean, I do kind of like this clock though. It's $10, but it says, take it easy. Okay, now I'm all for the food at Home Goods. I've bought a lot of things, but what the heck is this? It's a pie, or maybe it's like a tart or something, or a tort, whatever you want to call it, but it's on clearance, y'all, for a whopping $5. <laughs> I was like, I don't know what this is. Why are they selling pie at Home Goods? But I do love the chocolates, the pasta sauce, the seasonings. I mean, the Himalayan salt. I, who hasn't bought a big bag of that? Y'all, these are my favorite chips. I come to Home Goods just to get this chip. It's got all the different seasonings combined in it, and it's like four bucks a bag or whatever, but the, and they're super crispy. These are my favorite chips, and I only come to Home Goods to get them. Other chips are also really, really good. You should try it. Okay, now in this aisle, um, this is where I found more of that China stuff, you know, like all white. There was Mikasa, there were other bone China, really inexpensive. If you're looking to build um, China, this okay. is great. So I wanted to tell you about these bowls here. So there's like plain white bowls that are $3.99 each. Oh, there's more back here too. Um, and I have this white china that is from my wedding registry that I have not even used, or actually I needed to use it this year for something and then I didn't have enough of them. So I came to Home Goods looking to find something close because it's from Crate and Barrel. It's from 20 years ago and it's just like a thin white bone china pattern, but it's like a low dish bowl. So I came here and I found plates actually that match. I just found them in the clearance section and they're just a plain white plate. But now I'm looking for bowls that kind of go with it like that, like kind of low gumbo bowl type, whatever, which I don't really see those, but they have the round ones and they're $3.99 a piece. I'm gonna figure um, out plans and oh, okay. anyways, 
I love these bowls and I think they would be really, really great with the rest of the stuff that I have. But I think that's really outside of my budget today since I'm only spending $25. And I keep rumbling the aisles going like, what else am I gonna get? Maybe I'll get a candle. I feel like a candle is a good, sure far away. I wish I could buy a, like a little, like a pan. I have pans and pots. I love to cook. Have I mentioned that before? Um, I need, I need nothing, actually. Let's see, I see a can opener thing. That looks interesting. Um, like, hello. This would be really interesting because it's for mason jars and things. And it's $6. This looks very functional and like it might need to go home with me. Just saying. Um, <gasps> tongs. We need tongs because our other tongs just broke. It's also at $7. I don't know. I might have to get rid of some stuff in here. I might have to do process of elimination. We'll see what we come up with. But we definitely need some tongs <laughs> because I just... The pin fell out of the other ones we had we've had for eight years. They rest and they fall apart. They're really I want a scoop. Ooh. Okay, put that in buddy. Now I wish I had more than $25. This is what always happens. Always. Always, always, always ha happens to me. <gasps> this is three dollars. I need a scoop for my oatmeal, my dry oatmeal and my rice. <clears throat> okay, I think I am I am past my budget here and I'm gonna calculate some things and see where I'm at right now and then I'm gonna go back and see where I'm up to at this moment and see what I need to kick out of my cart and what I want to keep okay I'll be right back okay so here's what I'm getting I'm getting the spoon that I really liked I'm getting the scoop that I need. I'm getting the tongs that I also need. All this I need, right? I can justify this as a need. The mid-size cookie sheet. And bonus, I'm gonna add one more white plate to my collection so that if I have more people come to eat, we'll be good. Now the, there's one more plate for $3, but I'm not, I'm gonna stop because I only wanna spend what I have on my card. And I brought a another um, Visa gift card that I found on my nightstand just in case I need something else for tax because I think just a couple of dollars are on that. And that's it. So I'm gonna go to the checkout and then we'll be done. This was fun. This was so fun. else instead of that plate and um, anyway I ended up getting this tortilla warmer because I've been making my own tortillas lately and making a Mexican food and I've always kind of wanted one of those so I did go over my budget a tiny bit only by the subtotal was $25.95 which means with tax it was 182 so I went two dollars and 77 cents over my budget which I'm really not sad about I got a whole bag full of things that I needed for $25 brand new from home goods I'm really excited about it this was a fun trip so I'm gonna have to stay away from home goods for a while until I get another gift, gift certificate <laughs> but um, you know what all of these things are really useful and I'm excited to add them to my kitchen. So I'm gonna go home now and I'm gonna get out of this hot car and wash my stuff and put it away until we go shopping next time and looking for furniture and um, 
and looking at thrift stores and going to home goods you guys have a blessed day if you could give my channel a thumbs up this show a thumbs up as well as leave a comment and subscribe that really helps my channel out a lot i love any feedback that you have thank you so much for sticking with me i hope you'll stick around and want to watch more i have a lot of fun and exciting videos up in the near future that I can't wait to share with you. So y'all have a wonderful day and I'm going to go take a nap. <laughs> Bye.